Hello, my friends, and welcome to MB Shoe Doc, where we take the ordinary and make it extraordinary. We will be covering the art of patina and shine and learn to breathe new life into old shoes. So grab your dyes and polishes and get ready to get your hands dirty, and let's dive right into today's project. Alright, quick little video here. This is a pair of Carlos Santos field boots I've had for a little while. And the leather is uh, still in great shape, but the, the suede, it just looks, I don't know, it just kind of has lost some of its color. It just looks a little bit, um, almost like kind of ashy. It doesn't show up too well on camera, but um, to my eyes, it just looks a little bit faded. It just doesn't look as nice anymore. So I'm going to look at doing a little touch-up on the coloration. So first I'm going to take the laces out of here. And then I have mixed a little bit of Angelus dark brown and light brown. This is their suede dye. And just seeing if we can give these a little touch up. And if this doesn't kind of richen the color a little bit, I'm hoping that it will. So I'm just using a brush here. Now when I first put this on, it's going to look a fair amount darker. But it does tend to lighten up after a short bit. With suede, you do need to kind of go back and forth both directions to make sure you get all of the nap. And what I may plan to do is maybe I'll do one boot first and leave the other one alone to start. That way I can get a little bit of a comparison photo. But I like the way this is looking already. You know, it looks darker now. Again, it's going to lighten up some. But I think it's just going to be a little more saturated, just a little more rich, full color to it. I think this is going to end up looking a little bit nicer. Since it's fall, you know, I'm kind of getting into wearing some of my boots again and just kind of taking a look at all of them, doing a little bit of maintenance like this on, on some things that I hadn't worn for a while. Once I'm done, and to me that does look a little bit nicer already. I think once it dries, it'll be good. Let's see if you can compare these. Yeah, just a little richer color on this, more of a chocolatey brown compared to this. So I'll go ahead and get this entire one done, let it dry, and we'll see what it's looking like. I am really thrilled with this outcome. So here is the boot that has been re-dyed. Again, I mean, all I can say is just a much richer, true chocolate brown instead of this kind of ashen, dark brown here. So, so glad. Uh, I was really hesitant to do this project. I just didn't know if I was going to be happy with the color. I was afraid it would be too light uh, or it wouldn't just match with the leather. But this looks to me much, much nicer. So I'm going to go ahead and get the other one done. I don't uh, have any hesitation at this point. It looks great. And I 
think they look great. Honestly, I don't think I've liked these boots this much since I very first got them. It's a subtle difference, but I can absolutely tell the difference. I'm really happy with the way this suede is looking. It's kind of the way I always expected it to, to look. Ever since I got them, I always thought the, uh, the suede part looked a little rough, and I was really happy with the, the lower part. The leather was looking good, so I think the suede looks as good as the leather. Hope you enjoyed this quick little video. See you on the next one.